sorry about the lighting. But this will be my last video for the week. And here's some points I'm going to get across for various different reasons. I'm going to sit down for you on this one. Now, oh, I actually took a picture. Now, um, I named this video Obama Can't Rule White People, I believe, for this one reason. The society we live in is a sham. It's a lie. Everything that we've ever seen, everything that we've ever thought we've known has been fed to us to guide us in a certain direction. Through the course of our country's history, there have been people dying for causes that they can never explain. There have been people falling to the wayside of American society throughout history. Our time on this world is definitely limited. And all that we can do is the best for each other and try to be friends with those who we believe to be our enemies. Those white people that we have grown to hate in life have been lied to just as well as we have. But the thing is, with a changing people's perspective, you must first make them see what they could not see. Turn on the light so the blind can see. But, if we have been raised in a form of systematic apartheid, systematic racism, systematic divide and conquerism, then you have to come to one conclusion. Everything that we have been told as Americans has been a lie. The truths that they told are so well blended into the lies we don't even understand what is true anymore. How can I sit here and try to plead to white people and tell white people that they've been lied to when they still have the upper hand in 95.5% of the things that go on in this country? But you have to also understand this, white people. You will not listen to a black man as president because of the stereotypes in which you've been raised around. Obama cannot rule because America is still mostly white. Obama cannot rule because most of America's worst for workforce is Hispanic. Obama cannot rule because Obama looks like a black man. Obama can't not rule because the black people don't see Obama as black enough. Obama cannot rule because he looks too much like a nigger. Black people won't fuck with him because he looks too much like a rich nigger. Poor people won't fuck with him because he communicates with the niggers. White people won't fuck with him because they can relate him. And what? White people won't fuck him. White people gon' fuck him. White people won't mess with him because they can't relate to him because he appears to be different. Obama cannot rule because of the appearance of a nigga. If he ever flared up and got mad, he'd be gone because he appears to be a nigga. When you look at Obama, he don't look like me. He don't look like you. He don't live like me. I'm not going to Harvard. Obama is someone who struggled to make it. Obama is someone who made it to a point to where he isn't recognized by all the people of this country. Obama will not be the President of the United States of America because he's too dark. He's a brown skin. Obama does not speak like the average American of African descent. I hate that. Obama is doing what Obama can do. He can talk to the people, bring up awareness. But when you look at Obama, Clinton, and McCain, what do they have that you don't have? Money! 
They got money. The average American don't have no money. The average American is trying to find out how to get some money. The average American has nothing. The average American is scared to death that some Mexican person is going to take a job that they never ever fucking applied for in the first place. America is in flux. Obama cannot rule because Obama is still perceived to be a black person. We will not have a leader that is not white until we can recognize that there is no color. We cannot have a leader that is a female until we recognize men don't rule everything. Obama cannot rule because of white people. Obama will not be the president of the United States because of white people. White people don't like to listen to black people at work. White people do not like to listen to anyone other than a white person when it comes to telling them what is best for their lives and what to do. I can sit here until I'm blue in the face to tell all these white people who are in the same economic boat that I'm in, you have lost. You haven't lost your power. You have lost your freedom because you don't have what the top 5% have. That is money. And Obama got money. Obama can get you to spend your money. Obama cannot rule over white people because his skin is too dark. Now if Obama was, uh, say, uh, say, uh, say if Obama was um, Switch from Switzerland, you know, American kid, you know, you know, from Switzerland, you know, born in Switzerland, you know, army, family, whatever, then he comes here and he might have a little, you know, olive complexion. If Obama was Giuliani, Giuliani would be the president. If Obama was uh, Bill Richardson, Bill Richardson would be the president. But Obama, who do they call him? Uh, what they say his whole his whole name his name is Arabic we're at war with the Arab countries with the war the Arab nations Obama cannot lead because of his name because of his skin color and because what he represents he looks like a black man he looks like Tiger Woods Obama cannot lead because those who don't understand color will not follow. Those who have not struggled, Hillary ain't never been called a nigger. Those people will not allow Obama to be the leader of the free world. How can America be represented by one of their slave descendants? Obama cannot lead because of his skin tone. He don't sound like a white man when, when you make him upset his voice gets black on you. Obama. Obama won't have the opportunities that the regular black person has because Obama got some money. Obama does not represent every black in America because Obama got some money. Obama does not represent the poor in America because Obama makes money. Poor people don't make money. Poor people are the cause of why America has to spend money. Like somebody once told me, America rushed to help other countries, but America won't help Mexico. And Mexico right next door. Obama Will you stop the Mexican slave trade? Obama. Will you stop the sexual slave trade? Obama. Will you free the slaves finally? Obama cannot lead because Obama is still perceived to be a black person, a person of color. And people of color do not run or guide the United States of America. Obama 
has been too.